Hola! Hey guys, welcome to Serenity Sanctuary. I am Miss Serenity Oasis, your favorite spiritual advisor. I am a psychic medium and a spiritual practitioner. I do all kinds of spell work. If you're interested in a tarot card reading or any spell work, make sure that you inbox me or DM me on Facebook or Instagram at Miss Serenity Oasis. And welcome Team Serenity. Yes, and if you're here, that means that you are a part of the team. And I'm happy that you're here. And we're going to all win together. Trust me on this. But today, something that I really want to discuss with you guys, because this is something that I need to make sure that all of you know, and all of you understand and understand. Okay, if you're going to be a part of the team, and we're going to be doing spell work together, listen, a Full tarot card reading is required first and foremost from me. If you would like for me to do spell work for you, and these are oracle cards. So let me just grab my tarot cards because I want to give you guys a full visual of exactly what I mean and exactly what I'm talking about. Tarot cards, tarot reading. Yes, I require for you to have a full tarot card session. And you know what? I don't know why my phone does this with this lighting. Whenever I am recording or doing a video, it's like the lighting goes from being light to dark. But you know what? That's duality, sweetheart. That's just another lesson. There's a lesson in every single thing. And this brief lesson is brought to you by spirit. Okay? We need light and dark in every single aspect of our life. We need to be balanced because that's what that's going to represent. A even balance in our life all around. And you know why? Because somebody needed to hear that. Anywho, getting back to what I was saying. Yes, a full tarot card reading is required first and foremost if we're going to have a session together. And you know why? Because I'm going to start, let me start all the way from the beginning. I'm going to tell y'all straight up, okay? I'm not trying to be funny and I love you guys very much, but I do not trust y'all humans. I don't trust y'all humans at all whatsoever. Period. Boo. Like, I really do not. You know why? Because there's a lot of dishonest people that are walking on this planet. There's so many dishonest humans and I deal with all kinds of people all the time, every single day. So people, in order to get their way and to bend things to their will through spell work, they will come with all kinds of outrageous stories. These humans will come and they will tell me all type of stories about, you know, they need a love spell because they want to separate this man from this woman that's coming in between their relationship. And, you know, they need to get this man back. In all reality, this man is probably married and she's probably the one coming in between their relationship. So not to say that I don't trust y'all humans, but long story short, I don't trust y'all humans. I cannot trust y'all humans, like period, point blank. And because of that fact, I have to have a full tarot card session done with you first and foremost so that I can get more insight into what exactly is going on in your life. I need to be able to see what is going on with the situation. If you want a love spell, any sort of love spell, it doesn't matter if you are trying to attract a new love to your life. It doesn't matter if you are trying to bring your significant other back to reconciliate. We can do a reconciliation spell. It doesn't matter if you want to bring more passion and excitement into your life. It doesn't matter if you want to spruce up your sex life, whatever it is that you are seeking. If you want to sweeten up your marriage, there's so many different type of love spells. But for before I do any love spell for anyone, please understand the first thing I'm going to suggest is for you to do a tarot card reading prior before we even discuss spell work because I, as your spiritual practitioner, need to see what the exact problem is. I need to see what is going on. I need to see the circumstances. I need to see the situation. I need for spirit to show me these things. I don't need for you to tell me what's going on. So this is one of the main reasons why there's actually two reasons within the explanation that I just mentioned. The first one is because I don't trust y'all humans. I don't trust y'all humans stories. 
fabrications, all of that kind of stuff. You humans know what y'all be doing sometimes. And I don't trust it. I need to see for myself. And the second reason within that explanation is because I need for spirit to show me exactly what is going on without you saying a word about it. I need to be able to shuffle these cards, speak to my deck, speak to my spirit team, your spirit team. And I need to see what's really going on around you. Is it the way that you are interpreting it to me because it could be something else that's going on and you your perspective you're viewing it as one way that it's not so you're thinking that you need spell work in all reality you may not even need spell work you see so we have to allow spirit to show us exactly what is going on around you okay because you may need some more clarity you may need some more insights so this is another reason why you have to have a full tarot card session done prior to your session. I don't like when you guys hit me up with these long paragraphs and telling me, oh, you know, you can give me a brief overview of whatever it is that you may be going through. You may say, hey, you know, I'm looking to have a love spell done because my husband and I have separated and I want to see how we I can bring us back together. You can give me a brief overview like that. But please do not give me a whole breakdown of, you know, my husband, he was cheating on me with this woman for three years. She got pregnant. She had a child. We always arguing over money issues. Do not tell me any of those details. Just give me a brief overview and then we can have a full tarot card reading because I need to let spirit show me. You don't even have to waste your breath and waste your energy on explaining to me prior to our session what's going on in your life let's allow spirit to show us and the energy i'm feeling right now is so strong from these tarot cards and these tarot cards have definitely been charged and they are definitely cleansed and these see i have so many different decks of cards that i use baby these cards right here these tarot cards they are called the wild unknown tarot deck and the energy is so powerful from this tarot deck okay like this is one of my favorite decks also that I like to use when you really want the fucking truth and you really want to let spirit get in somebody business. This will be the deck of cards I will be using. So listen, that's exactly why you have to come have a full tarot card session with me because we got to let spirit get all in your business and see exactly what the fuck is going on. So the next reason why you have to have a full tarot card session with me prior to doing any spell work is because a lot of times when people are doing spell work, you're doing spell work on other people, okay? If you're doing spell work on another person, the same way that you and I may be spiritually protected, this person may be strongly, heavily spiritually protected as well. I have to be able to see during a session with spirit exactly, you know, how which way we can get around certain things in certain circumstances okay a lot of times you know spirit will say oh that's easy go ahead whatever but if you're going to be doing spell work on somebody who is heavily protected spiritually then guess what i have to be able to see from spirit what it is that i have to do to go around that protection of that person i have to be able to see you know how do we work around certain things, okay? So that is another reason why a full tarot card session is required first, because you go trying to fuck with somebody, putting some shit on somebody, not knowing how their protection is set up, and guess what? That shit backfires on you and fuck your ass up because you didn't know what you were doing or because you went to a spiritual advisor, a tarot card reader, a psychic medium, whatever title you want to give us, a witch, a root worker, the root lady, the woo lady, whomever, okay? You went to someone to put some shit on somebody and all they did was take your money and charge you a fee and didn't even look prior to see what was going on and now your life is being fucked up in return or you're trying to do some shit on your own. No, we need divination. We need to consult with spirit. We need spirit to show us how this person protection set up. What's the best route to go? Okay, so the next reason why a full tarot card session is required prior to having a full, um, I'm sorry, 
Another reason why a full tarot card session is required prior to having any spell work done by me is because everyone's situation and circumstances are different. And because of that, all of my spells are customized. Each and every single one of my spells are customized to what each and every single one of my clients need. So unless, because remember, there's exceptions to every rule. Unless I am doing a group ritual, a group spell work, then that is different. That's a group ritual, it's group spell work, it's the same spell that will be used for everyone during a certain time frame. Now, if you're coming to me because you have a specific problem, then guess what? Your situation may be different from somebody else's situation. So if you come to me and you're like, hey, I need a love spell, I cannot just say, okay, no problem, um, $150 and I'll do your love spell. No, it doesn't work like that. And my prices are not set up like that either. Trust me on this. Okay. But what I'm saying is, I don't even know what's going on in your life. And I'm just going to do a love spell, a general love spell, the same love spell that I do for everyone. It makes no sense. I have to know what your situation is. I need to know the circumstances of your situation. I need to know the role that you play in this situation, whether it's good or bad. Also, you know, I need to see what spirit is advising or whatever type of spell work it is that you are trying to do. We need spirit to show us the best route to take for whatever it is that you're trying to manifest. If you're trying to manifest a job, I need to know, are you even looking for a job? Because it wouldn't make any sense for you to be the type of person where you're lazy as hell and you're like, oh, I'm just going to pay you to do a love spell. I mean, a money spell for me to get a new job. And please keep in mind also, there's different money spells too. There's different types of spells. So you're going to need something different than the next person. I'm going to use the love spell as the example. If someone comes to me and they're like, hey, I need a love spell. Okay, no problem. First and foremost, let's do a full reading. Let's see what's going on in your life. Spirit may show me that you separated from your husband three months ago and you want to bring you guys back together. You want to get back in a re romantic relationship with this person. And guess what? Some shit is over there falling. But let me tell you something. It's always a, a spiritual occurrence happening around here. Okay. But back to what I was saying. You may want to bring you guys closer together, get back in a romantic relationship. So guess what? Your, what will be required for a spell for you is going to be different than somebody who is saying, listen, I am single. I am trying to manifest a new love, a new person, a new energy. So when you think about it, the two of you will need two different types of love spells. You may have blockages in the middle of your way, so you may need blockages removed prior to even doing spell work. This person may have no blockages, no problems. Everything is great. Everything is lovely. So it's less work that has to be done. So guess what? The prices are going to vary, which brings me to the next reason why it is very important to have a full tarot card session prior to spell work being done is because... That is where I will give you the price of your spell work, okay? I don't have one price fits all for spell work when it comes to my spells, okay? You may be used to going to people who may have tell you, oh, I charge $175, which I don't see how they do, but... Oh, I charge $175 for money spells. I charge $130 for love spells. Listen, it doesn't work that way over here because remember, you are going to get what you pay for at the end of the day with anything that you decide to invest in. Because remember, when you're spending your money, it should not just be a purchase. It should be an investment. So you're going to spend quality money for quality work. Please keep that in mind. So yes, if you want quality results, you're going to spend quality money. So please keep that in mind when you are going to come to me to have a session. But I cannot determine the price of your spell work because all of my spell work is customized based on what you need. 
You know, you may need something that is way more difficult to do for you and way more challenging to do for you because of the circumstances of your life compared to someone else. Even if you guys need the same thing, you know. So therefore, I cannot give you any prices of spell work because I don't know what's going on with you. I cannot say I am charging X amount of dollars and come to find out I haven't even seen what the fuck is going on in your life. And this shit is so chaotic. And, you know, I have to do way more stuff in order to help you manifest this. I have to remove all these different blockages. I have to give you spiritual baths. You know, there's certain things that we may have to do prior to doing the spell work. So I cannot give you a price for spell work unless you come have a full tarot card reading done by me. That's another reason why, because I can't give you any prices. All I can tell you is if you can't afford a reading, then you cannot afford my spell work. Trust me on this. That's the only thing that I can sit here and tell you. I can't tell you anything different because there's a lot of times that people come to me and the first thing they say is that, oh, I need spell work. Oh, I want you to do spell work. But then when I tell them that they have to have a full tarot card reading, they don't have the money to pay for a full tarot card reading. So, sweetheart, if we got to take life one step at a time, y'all be trying to put the cart before the horse. Okay. You got to put the horse before the cart one step at a time. First and foremost, be able to come and afford to have a full tarot card reading done by me. Trust me, you will not regret it. Believe me on this. And do not forget to follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and YouTube. Make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you are on Facebook, which is at Miss Serenity Oasis, please be sure to read my reviews on my page, okay? Because I have reviews on my page and also you can see some video reviews as well. If you are on my TikTok, my Instagram or my Facebook page, I have video reviews also. Please understand that it will be worth the experience that you're gonna have with me during our session will be worth every single penny of it. And when we do spell work together, I'm going to know exactly which way to go to hit whatever fucking goals and targets we are trying to reach. No matter if it's in your love life, your career life, with your kids, your neighbors, you know, within you to heal. I'm here. So, yes. Please understand for all of these reasons and for all of these purposes, this is exactly why a full tarot card session is required first and foremost. If you cannot afford, this is no offense to anybody, but one thing about me that you guys know is that I'm going to always be straightforward, honest, open, speak my mind, tell you how it is. I'm not sugarcoating anything. We got to, I'm coming to you straight up. If you cannot afford a tarot card session, then you cannot afford my spell work. First and foremost, you have to inquire about a tarot card session. And, you know, after the session, then you can determine where, if you want to do spell work or not. Because sometimes spell work may not be required. There may be other solutions that you need to do. You may need a spiritual bath instead. And then guess what? Bam, you save some money because you didn't even need the spell work. You just thought that you needed it. You thought that you wanted it. You know, you may feel like you want to be in a relationship with someone and you want to bring your ex back, your toxic ass ex that I be asking y'all to leave alone. You want to bring him right back and, and get him. And then we may have a session together and spirit may show you where like you are so much better than this. This person doesn't deserve you. This job don't deserve you. Don't do all of this to keep this relationship when it's toxic as fuck. Spirit may show you some shit that make you say, you know what? You're absolutely right. And I don't even, I don't need him. I don't need to do spell work to keep this person in my life. I don't need to do that. Spirit may, you know, bring forth some, aha, uh -huh, you know, those aha moments like, <gasps> Yes, that's it. Ding, 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 ding. I don't really need that. You know, there may be other solutions. You may think, oh, you're cursed. Oh, you're hexed. And spirit may say, listen, you just have a dark cloud around you. You have a lot of negative energy around your aura that you need to release. So in that case, you may not need, oh, I need a hex removed. You may not need it. One thing about me, I am a very honest person 
practitioner, any of my regular clients will tell you, or anyone who knows me and who have worked with me before will tell you, I will never suggest spell work that you do not need. If spirit is not showing me during this session that you need this work done, I'm going to honestly tell you, you don't need it done. I'm not here just to get your money. I am genuinely here to help you guys manifest whatever it is that you are seeking to manifest. As long as spirit gives us the okay and the go ahead, then we can definitely proceed. And I cannot wait to work with you guys. This is definitely a decision and an investment that you will not regret. Trust me on this. So yes, if you guys are interested in having any spell work done, as I have stated in this entire video, a full tarot card session is required first and foremost by me. And last but not least, another thing that I want to say, there's a lot of people who may come, to, well, not a lot, but there's a few people who have come to me in the past and I have told them that they need a full tarot card session done first. And they will tell me things like, oh, well, I just went to another tarot card reader last week, a few days ago, and she told me that this is what's going on and blah, blah, blah. That's fine and that's dandy and that's absolutely okay if that is what you like to do. However, I cannot go based off of what spirit told them. I have to go based off of my spirit team and, you know, the tools that I use to consult with spirit directly one on one myself. And I open myself up and use myself as a portal to receive messages from spirit on your behalf. If it's not coming from my spirit team, that is not what I am going to go by. Okay. So yes, this, the reading has to be done by me. You can't tell me you went to somebody else the other day. That's wonderful, but you're here now. And this is how we operate in Serenity's sanctuary. Okay. So guys, do not forget, if you want a full tarot card reading done or some spell work done, you can inquire and inbox me or DM me on Facebook or Instagram at Miss Serenity Oasis. And do not forget to follow me and like my Facebook, my Instagram, my Twitter, my TikTok, and my YouTube. Subscribe to my YouTube channel at Miss Serenity Oasis. I am going to have so much more content for you guys. I'm finally back and at it, and I'm very excited. And do not forget to inbox me or comment below if there's any different topics that you want to discuss or that you want me to make a video on. And I got you. I promise. And thank you guys for being a part of the team. Don't forget to like and to share this video because there's so many people who need to hear this. And guess what? There's so many people who need Miss Serenity in their lives. So make sure that you share this video. And I hope that you guys have a lovely rest of your day. I love you. And if you meet me, you know where to find me here at Serenity Sanctuary. Love you guys.